Hello and welcome to my.homecampus.com.sg. Okay, in this lesson we learn how we multiply numbers. So the question given to us is find the product of 231 and 3. Well, the word product means times or multiply. Okay, so the product of 231 and 3 actually means to time 231 by 3 or multiply 231 by 3. So on our model diagram, this is how it would look like if this unit, say it represented or it stood for 231, then what we have to find out actually is how much would be 3 times of this unit. Okay, so 3 times of this unit would obviously be 3 times of this unit. So that all together. So the product of 231 and 3 is 231 times 3. Well, now we know what product means. Product means to multiply. But how do we actually carry out the multiplication? Well, let's see. Well, as usual, we'll carry out the visual steps of multiplication here in our place value chart in the middle of the screen. And on the right side of the screen, we'll do the working. Okay, so we have to do 231 times 3. Let's put 231 in the place value chart. So we have 200s, three tens and one ones. Now when we have to multiply it by three, what we actually have to do is multiply each of the ones, the tens and the hundreds by three. Now the first step is to multiply the ones by three. So there is one ones and we multiply that by three. So what happens in the place value chart? How do we do that? Well, there is a single one here in the ones place. And if we do three times of that, we get three of those. So there would be three ones. One times three is three. So one ones times three is three ones. Next, we move on to multiplying the tens by three. So now there are three tens. And when we multiply three tens by three, what do we get? Well, we get one and two more of those. So one, two, and three sets of three tens. So three times three, or three tenths times three is nine tenths. So there you go, there are nine tenths. Finally, the third step is to multiply the hundreds by three. Now there are two hundreds, okay? So when we multiply two hundreds by three, we get three sets of two hundreds. So three sets of two hundreds are equal to six hundreds, right? So two times three is six, or two hundreds times three is six hundreds. So there you go, 231 times 3 is equal to 600, 9 tens, and 3 ones. Let's summarize the steps one more time, okay? So 231 times 3, the first step is to multiply the ones by 3. 1 times 3 gives us 3. The next step is to multiply the tens by 3. So there are 3 tens times 3, so that would be 9 tens. Finally, 200 times 3. 200 times 3 is 600. So the product of 231 and 3 is 693. Well, that brings us to the end of this lesson. For uh, more such questions, practice exercises, and worksheets, visit my.homecampus.com.sg. This is M signing off for now. Bye bye.